<laughs> Welcome back to Team Fat Get Juice Fat. This is the Party Cast Thursday. I'm Jason. This is Alex. This is Dennis. This is Dory. I was scratching myself on that side. All right, so uh, we have some things and things. Wee! Some stuff and some. We things. do have. We, stuff. Have, we have ideas. We've got. We got. Some I have a couple too. ideas. Do you have? Do you have a? You did not. You don't have a. Thing. I'm about to. Okay. All right, so um, where do we want to start? Uh, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna ghost call Steel in a little bit, um, yay! And see if he answers the phone. He has no idea what's going on. Yay! Um, it's even better. So uh, while uh, Alex is pulling out the uh, the, the hops roulette game, there's also I special... have an what? idea. There's also a special uh, surprise up in the freezer on the other side. Oh, let's start there. That's a good idea. No. Uh, not the other one. Let's do that first. That's a good idea. Right? I like it. Uh, where's your shot glass? I got mine right here. <laughs> we'll pass that on down to the butcher. The butcher. So, uh, you want to explain what the hell we're about to do in all of our bad decisions? <laughs> and we're about to make even more bad decisions. Um, yes. Because it is the Thursday party cast. It is the Thursday party cast. And, um, well, we were able to get a hold of the... Procure. The, yeah, procure a bottle of Jameson Cold Brew Irish Whiskey. It is a... So limit. is this like a, a coffee version of Jameson? Yes, it is Jameson Irish Whiskey infused no. with a natural cold brew coffee flavor. Oh, okay. Yeah, and it's a limited edition, so... and the. You had to you had to run away and we go we did have to run and go get it because the AB store just got it today and they already were down to like five bottles. So well, I mean, next weekend is St. Patty's Day, right? Truth. Um, now that we are no longer, uh, well, Dooley and I are no longer in the uh, the industry of Irish things. <laughs> Alex. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold yeah, pass me, the cup. pass me the cup. I was gonna say, he could have just passed it this way, but okay. Okay, well, that's what works, too. I'm not saying. You know, I like, forget, man. Like, we're always on the rotation. I know. So, um, Dooley and I are usually off <laughs> on St. Patrick's Day. Because ain't nothing going on. Yeah, not, I'm happy this time, because I'm actually going to be off the day after St. Patrick's Day, so I'm going to be good. Yeah, but by the time you get off work, it's like already 7. Like It doesn't matter. The parties don't close till 2. Yeah, I got a little Irish on that one. No, I can't. <laughs> you know what? You know, the producer doesn't want to taste it. Okay, okay. so it, it's, here's to us, and also... So it's like an Irish coffee it, yeah. in a bottle. And at the same time, like I said I was going to do it, but uh, to my dad. Cheers. Yo. 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 Oh, that's delicious. The fuck it is, dude. Actually, yeah. Actually, that was really good. That's like right, straight black coffee. That's good. Yeah. If I liked coffee, that would be good. Yeah. <laughs> I got like a booger or something. I'm happening. not going to lie. Like, I can see the appeal. Yeah. I'm just not a coffee fan. Okay. It's coffee. It's my turn. Mike. Fuck no. Oh, you're not involved. Producer, please, if you would. Uh oh. She's hype. Oh, oh, hell no. Oh. Hell no. Oh. Dennis and Dooley, I got five bucks in my pocket for each of you. If you can <laughs> dip a toothpick inside the one million Scoville unit capsaicin $10. extract. Ten dollars. It's you know, it's, it's well if if you do it and Dooley doesn't, you get ten. Okay. Ten dollars I got cash money. You actually got cash? Cash money. I had to get it from the producer. I know. Oh. Now I know why this one's being recorded. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> well, we can't just do it and no one see it. So, five bucks a piece or ten dollars for one, who's going to fucking chicken out and who's going to dip a toothpick in this bad boy? I kind of want to chicken out just so we could do some, like, uh, questions. <laughs> Dennis. Dennis, Dennis, are you going to do it for ten bucks? I'll do it for ten dollars. Ten dollars? We dip... Oh. Actually, uh, damn, I didn't even like it's still sealed. Like I, I didn't, I didn't even open the bottle. I don't know how. Um, like I kind of want to be stupid. Yeah, I know. I knew. You I got were. a beer in front of me, and I got a bottle of whiskey. I'm good. I just want to know the reaction. Like we're just talking about dipping a toothpick. You know, and, like, how, how, how much of a toothpick? Just a uh, tip, just, bro. It's just a tip, yeah. bro. Just for a second. <laughs> just for a second. Just see how it feels. I'm. <laughs> I'm gonna be the one dipping the toothpick. Well, you just have to yeah, put it in your you, mouth. You could do this one. 
Hey. Oops. Look, it's, it's hey, too much. Hey, how much money I spent on alcohol today? I'll do it. <laughs> I still remember I did that to a flashbang. Okay. I think Here it's been at least about a hundred. Oh, so it was like half an shit, inch. dude. It's ready. Whoa. That no. shit looks like an iodine bottle. Yeah, just yeah. a tip, bro. Not, not too fucking crazy. <laughs> One million Scovilles for ten bucks? I've done the fucking Leviathan, so I'm like, but... You know. What was the Leviathan? Between it's one million like and sixteen, one in 16 million. million. Yeah. That looks uh, like the oh fucking God. solo cup. Go ahead and pass that on down. Damn. Yeah, I'm taking a picture of it. <laughs> well, it's stick it in your mouth. It looks make. like you just stabbed yourself. Right? He's letting it absorb into the tip thing. That is not fair. It, it smells like hot. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you think hot smells and, like. Oh, okay, so it. I read this earlier. And like, says, you know that bitter that bitter capsaicin smell? It, it says, Go warning, stick food it in there, man. only. Skin irritant. Like, No, that's not it. Stick it in your mouth. There. What are you doing, man? You're supposed to hold it in your mouth. That's gonna, I, that's I, gonna be sufficient. <laughs> Trust me, it's sufficient. I would not I'm do that. I'm pretty sure that all of the liquid is off of the toothpick, but the stain it has left behind is not, which you're I'm sure he is like, now feeling. You're already purple. <laughs> Here, go ahead and pass that on down to Dennis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even... I'm oh, scared of that. That should... <laughs> oh, shit. You should wear gloves when... <laughs> <laughs> it does say skin irritant. I think that was covered. So, where, so uh, where are you at? Where are you at? It's got some kick. Oh, you know? uh, does it? Oh yeah. Does it have a flavor? No flavor at all. Just, it's just kick. hot. I mean, it, it is, is straight heat. It is yeah. capsaicin extract. So. Yeah. So it's just Dennis. straight capsaicin. Dennis. Look, look, look at the camera. Yeah. Let them know. <laughs> <laughs> so we're doing a trial run oh, on yeah. the uh, whole video cast. Um, are you okay there, bud? Wow. Well, Was it worth ten bucks? No. No. Yeah, I didn't think. I didn't That's think so why either. I didn't do it. <laughs> Yeah, because if you did it, it would have been five dollars a piece. <laughs> like, and then that Alex would be and I, less worth it. Al, Alex and I would just sit back and fuck. fucking walk. Oh fuck! There it is. There it is. Yeah. And what are you feeling right now? Oh, we should have switched seats for this one. Regret. <laughs> You're feeling regret. <laughs> All the regrets. <laughs> yeah. uh, well, go on. Drink, drink some of your coffee. <laughs> Maybe that, that cold maybe, brew. I mean, yeah, that, I, I'm, that, I'm just thinking maybe that might actually help. Like, do you need some lemon? We don't, we don't have any. <laughs> some lime juice, maybe? <laughs> we don't have any of that either. Um, we are completely out of citrus. There you go. <laughs> Does that help any at all? Nope. Uh, this is totally worth 10 bucks. Uh, I have lime, I have salt lime and vinegar juice chips. I don't fridge. know. I'm just saying what's in front of you. Don't. So. It's hot in here. Yeah. A little warm. Well, Jump. All right, so let's talk about the. Oh, where are you going? Are you, huh? you running away? <laughs> no. You, know, you look a little sweaty. We got. We oh, got the some hoodies coming off. <laughs> we got some topics to cover that we uh, missed out on on Monday. Okay, you want to start with those? Well, I was going to say you had something that about work you wanted to. You know, how was your week? We uh, we didn't yeah, finish. Right, you right, said right, we were right, going to uh, save it. Uh, uh, that on. was that was number one, and then uh, you know restaurants suck. If we want to. Okay, so elaborate on that. No, um, so uh, I believe it was Tuesday. Um, Dooley and I went to the food show. Yeah, yeah, that was last Tuesday. And we uh, was last Tuesday. Yeah, it was last Tuesday. Our mission, at, uh, obviously, besides stuffing ourselves and convincing uh, reps to drink beer, we were um, there to find uh, plant-based items. Okay, which is disheartening to say the least. Um, but we did find, I did, we, we found, a cauliflower <laughs> product that I did not hate. You okay there, bud? Yeah. <laughs> Take a walk? I <laughs> just got to spit. Real quick. <laughs> so I found, we found a cauliflower pizza crust that I did not despise. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh, it was actually, it was actually good. Like, it was okay. It didn't taste like cauliflower. It tasted like pizza crust. Yeah. It tasted like a Tatino's. Crust, which is shitty pizza to start with, but it tastes like a shitty pizza crust. Frozen. Not, cauliflower should just be what it is. Cauliflower. <laughs> See, now you're getting on board. Like, I've been on board. I <laughs> cauliflower doesn't need to be pizza crust. Or potatoes. Or potatoes. Or rice. Or fake chicken nuggets. Breakfast. Cereal. Like it doesn't need to be these things. 
But so I did find. Um, but we had we ran into, of course, the Impossible Burger and like the Beyond Burger, and of course they're having epic battles. Um, I have a question. How come we haven't seen Cauliflower Tapas yet? <laughs> because it shouldn't mm-hmm. exist, bro. Top and odd. <laughs> Shouldn't exist. <laughs> Here's my pickled because tapenade is already fucking vegetarian. Yeah, and they basically just cream it. You think that if they're making no. mashed potatoes out of this shit, somebody would have made tapenade. They are not or... making mashed potatoes out of cauliflower. Mm. Let's be honest, they're that making... shit is not mashed potatoes. No, it's cauliflower it's... mash. The Bullshit. producer, the producer is a big fan of it. She tries to make me eat it, but she also <laughs> she does. And she no, also, <laughs> like, she'll make it, and then she'll make mashed potatoes. <laughs> because she knows I won't eat that crap. I'll taste it. Like, speak. You'll like, taste it. You get a fucking <laughs> huge helping of it. You eat it, too. I will eat anything, first off. <laughs> like, let's, let's, I fucking let's, hate this shit. Give me, like, seven more bowlfuls. <laughs> I just said I made you it's mashed not potatoes. Un-edible. Don't eat my shit. It's not unedible. I will, like, well, she does, like, okay, the... Yeah, I had to steal some fries, though. <laughs> she, she cooks her cauliflower and chicken stock, so there you have it. Uh, I, I'm a meat man. Big fan. And so I will eat your... Your lips are so I eat your purple right now. <laughs> Stand closer to the camera so we can see that. Uh-huh. <laughs> All the regrets. All $10 worth of that shit. Uh, That's okay. <laughs> Because I just bought me a six pack. And I didn't. Oh, PBR? Yep. It's only 10 bucks? Actually, 12 packs is 10 bucks. But hey, you know. Well, can you see? Yeah. Are you good? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I just steal some of uh, little, the little producer's fr- french fries, though. They're not french fries. All right, all right, here's a good one. Ooh, Are they french did- fries <laughs> if they're not fried? Did you know Did you know the first french fry was not made in, Gre- in uh, France? In Greek? <laughs> I f- almost fucked it all yeah, up. Yeah, where we're... It's made in oh. Greece. No. Get it? All right, so uh. French fries <laughs> are not actually French. Yeah, we, we, we know that. They're no. not they're not freedom fries no, either. It's a dead, uh, it's I, a dead I, joke. I, I totally believe that. Uh, yeah, it's a dead joke, yeah. But are they French fries if they're not fried is a really good question. Duly. They're air fried. Why aren't you looking up um, the definition if, of a French yeah, fry? Yeah, like she air, oh, actual question. Uh, air fried, which means she put them in AF. a convection oven. She made so, fries AF. <laughs> Fries AF. Um, I don't. I, mean, I don't I, think they're French fries if they're not fried. They're it's air fried. In, it's in the word. Are they French fries if you put them in the oven? Yeah. Not I don't know why. Fried. Yeah. No. I. Are you waiting for me to answer you? He <laughs> no. was answering you. <laughs> what am I looking up? <laughs> are they French fries? If De- they, how about the, the definition, definition of, of a French, French fry? fry? The first thing I said. Does it have to be fried? And while you work on that, I'm gonna pull up his. Fucking man, my phone number. French crew. French fry. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> a thin strip of deep, deep fried potato. potato. So it is not a French fry if it is not deep fried. Oh. So it is now a fry. No, it's not a. It's a French. By the way, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I had them French taters. Thank you. By the way. By the way, what? You cleared my sinuses. No, thank you. Are they? Are they then French sticks? Hmm. Well. <laughs> Which is better than chopsticks. But are the frozen fresh fries flash fry to freeze them? I don't know. You you flash it first and then you fry them. I mean, what if we just cut a potato? Did y'all do a french fry episode? Yep, boiled it and then steamed it and then put it in the air fryer. And we fried them all. (laughs) (laughs) They were all deep fried. Oh, wait. Did we air fry? No. I think we did and it sucked. Yeah. We fucking sous That sounds about right. We sous vide fries. We did fries we a did lot of ways. We did the double fry. We did, like... Boiling and, steam. And, and the producer was very angry at us. Because... We spent all day doing fries. And then there were none left over. Because we ate, like, 30 pounds of fucking french fries. <laughs> and all she wanted to make was nacho fries. Well, I'm sorry. We ate them all. Because they nacho fries. <laughs> She's going to punch hey, you look like a French person. Yes. You don't save me <laughs> any French fries. You want to talk about the French fries? <laughs> just hold the cigarette. tell you. Yes, you do not save me the French fries. <laughs> you don't know the two <laughs> Yes. Can we, can we buy her one of those, like, cigarette the, 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 the extenders? The long yeah. stick thing? Just the cigarette I'm sure extender. they got one on Amazon. It's probably, like, fucking 50 bucks, mm-hmm. but whatever. 
What are you buying? Fucking ivory, man! Uh-huh. I bet you they make that shit out of something cheaper. Um, uh, not for the producer. <laughs> She's going to yell at you for spending $50. <laughs> Maybe it has a back scratcher attached to it. <laughs> back scratcher! <laughs> All right, we're going to do this shit real fast. Okay, you ready? Uh, I don't know. What right, shit? Yeah, yeah. We never know. Uh-huh. Oh, this shit. <laughs> oh, shit. We'll see what happens. If he answers. He's going to answer. I feel it. Oh, yeah. He better. I don't know. Yeah. Yes. There he is. Hey, Hello, what's up, bitch? The next motherfucking time I call your motherfucking punk ass at three o'clock in the morning at three a.m. Best be mother, California best be time. Fucking, you best be fucking answering that shit, California bitch. You're on the podcast you're on right the now. Fucking podcast <laughs> right now, bro. <laughs> that sexy bitch. All right, so hey, why you bring up old shit? <laughs> why why you gotta bring up old shit? No, because that's what we do. Um, you missed it. So you're here with uh, Alex, Dennis, the butcher, and Dooley, and the producer is here as well. So, so fucker. How you been? Hey, fuckers. Hey. Hey. Don't mind me. I, we I just, just figured out this shit worked today, so we were like, oh, we definitely poop on the side of the ho- highway, lately? Steel. You missed me eat some <laughs> capsaicin, though. Hey, oh, yeah. you're so lucky you called me right now because my phone has been working for shit. The last fucking three days. You're in California, we Well, pay your bill, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, the whole thing is like you have to pay your bill and the phone works. No, <laughs> the, fucking, the screen the screen froze up. I couldn't do shit. Like when I turned it on, it was just, just fucking black. I literally just got, I like literally just left the Apple store. We lay you... off the porn, Steel. <laughs> hey, what is that? He's in the car. Yeah. Are you backing up? No, he's got the door open. <laughs> no, I just started the car. I just got out of the Apple store. That was a door open. Oh, you literally just left the Apple store. So we called you. Literally. 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 Left the Apple store. (laughs) You like that? You like that? (laughs) Hey, and I may have made a pit stop at Lucille's real quick, though. I'm sure you did. What's Lucille's? The bar. Barbecue? Oh. Who's supposed to like barbecue? I've been to California. We were in yeah. California too. I was yeah. there a lot longer than you. Were. No, 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 put you on speaker. Huh? You, 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 no, you're on the podcast, bro. No, he said he's going to put us on ah. the speaker. He's in the car. Remember? It's True. California. You can't be on the phone. Hey, you hear me? But, yeah. yeah. Does every car right. does every car in California have a fucking speaker phone? Or is it just the Priuses? <laughs> I don't think so. I'm wait, have a wait, wait, still drives a Prius? No. Oh, thank actually, you. actually, him and Dooley drive the same fucking car. Okay. I got fucking hamsters. <laughs> you got Scion? What? I got Good hamsters. Reference. I don't Good have reference. a I don't have a generator. You have a generator for your car? No, I said I got hamsters. I don't have a generator. Oh, so do you feed them? Yeah. Do you feed them well? Do you still go to, uh, what was that place, Chad's or whatever? Chad's? Yeah, like, because we were in, like... The place where we used to play music and everything? No, no, like, the, like, where we hung out, like, with you. Oh! Dude, I haven't was been it? back there since. Yeah, good job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no more heat. And, I, 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 think, I think we overstand our welcome. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Like, you know, diner on one side, cheer on the other. Like it was fucking weird, and then like that, that fucking sign lied. Twenty four hour cocktails. <laughs> yeah, that still still gets your goat, huh? I was like, what the fuck? Like hell yeah! <laughs> Open twenty four hours. Yes, cocktails. That's not. It's not the same. It's poor advertisement. <laughs> Very poor. <laughs> and so, what? Are, what are gas prices over there now? Seven dollars. Shit, right now it ain't too bad. It's like only three forty-five. Not three forty-five. That's not that bad. It's like a dollar and a half more than we're paying. <laughs> yeah, we're paying like two, two eleven. Yeah. I just went into Phoenix last weekend, and the best they could come up with two, was two ninety-nine. Two ninety-nine for gas? Phoenix, Arizona. Yeah. In Phoenix. Phoenix, Arizona. Damn. Yep, Phoenix, Arizona. I forget over there the country gets smaller. Not really, but it does. I mean, yeah, like I mean, it's just like you. It all depends if you're up in northern or you're, southern well, California. So it's like, yeah. like from southern California, like you yeah. drive anywhere, and like you're in three different states. Truth. 
<laughs> you up north? Yeah, you're, you're driving driving, an hour driving and a half. from driving from Tijuana to like Washington is like what eight hours? No, nah, that's more. No, nah, I don't know. That's like twelve. No, no, it's more than that. You'll spend twelve hours just in California. Where Where were you at? Like, uh, where Depends are you from? Time like, where are you from in California? Tehachapi. Like what? originally. You did not say that when we were in the army. You were not from the t- t- Pasha Heath. Originally, he's from yeah, Fresno. I was born. I was born in Simi Valley. Where the hell is that? Just north of Los Angeles. Yeah. Yeah. Get ready for the next question. Where the hell is that? <laughs> where the hell is that? <laughs> um, where on the pig? <laughs> <laughs> right above the nuts. Right above the nuts. Second nipple on the left. The, the fucking armpit. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the the bottom ones or the top ones? Because like, uh, well, would that be a leg pit? <laughs> a leg, leg pit? pit? Yeah, a leg, leg pit. Oh, yeah. Like, they're all leg pits, really. Well, I guess I guess it all depends on which way the the pig's face. <laughs> um, from the asshole up. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, I remember, like, weren't you, like, uh, you, I I swear you were from Northern California. Oh, fuck no. Are you sure? <laughs> I'm fuck positive. So cow, right? bitch. <laughs> you know that valley? Valley is Southern California. Oh, well, we were in the valley and that shit sucks. Yeah. It's all <laughs> tofu and vegans. <laughs> oh. Oh, by no, the way, uh, March, March 26th, bro. March 26th? March 26th is the show. You were there. You witnessed us being there. So, March 26th. Food Network. So, so that's probably why I couldn't find the find the shit on the TV. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the commercials are running, but you can uh, definitely check it out like on March 26th. Like, sit your DVR. I still fucking taste that shit. Yo, yo. I've, so, uh, we have a uh, 1 million Scoville unit uh, capsaicin. capsaicin extract, and we dipped the toothpick in it and gave it to Dennis for 10 bucks, and he put the toothpick in his fucking mouth. <laughs> Fucking ten bucks. Ten bucks. <laughs> it was worth it. Every, was supposed it to be was only worth, five. Bro, but hey, it was. Bro, you need to fucking raise your standards. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was five. That's, if it was, that's, five, a, that's he, at least a twenty. That's he at least a down. twenty piece. It's a fucking chicken. He doubled down, <laughs> like because it was five for Dooley and Dennis, and but Dooley backed out, so he gave the ten bucks to Dennis if he put one million Scova units in his mouth. Yeah, that's at least that's at least a twenty piece and some chicken, <laughs> some biscuits. There's gotta be some biscuits. Maybe. In there. Hey, I don't know in California they might fries. charge you for the biscuits. They charge you for the biscuits. <laughs> it's California. They charge you for low air. Does it come in plastic? That's another ten. It could be the same price for ten dollars. You could also get a Popeyes chicken sandwich. <laughs> I'll take the yeah, wedding. I'll take the wedding for five fucking do you guys, hours. Do you have Popeyes over there? Yeah. Oh, so have you tried? Have you had the chicken sandwich? No, nah, hell no. <laughs> I'm about ready to wait in line for five fucking hours for a chicken sandwich. I mean, I figured you'd have fought your way through there by now. <laughs> <laughs> what about what about the Wendy's breakfast? The breakfast. What about the what? The Wendy's breakfast. The bacon is still delicious. By the way. In case you guys didn't know, and I don't know if you guys know this because you ate them so fast, but the the sausage is also a square. Yeah. Just like the burger. Yeah. Have you had the Wendy's breakfast? No, I have not. What the, What are you doing in your life over there? <laughs> it's just I'll stay fucking up his phone. Well, I mean, <laughs> he's Carl's Jr. all day. Like we know, we've gotten his car. <laughs> like, he got so excited, he, he busted his phone. <laughs> Yeah, I got so excited I busted my fucking phone. I, I couldn't <laughs> couldn't contain myself. <laughs> we we're, we're having a, a we, little bit of a issue. Uh, we're trying to figure out the whole Skype thing. So, uh, and we need to get your the, ass out with, here. Period. With the with the video cast, like we're trying to figure out how to get your face in the cast, like when we do a video podcast. So. Cause like right hey. now, we're, right now we're shooting a video podcast and no one can hear you. <laughs> well, no that's one. that's a bad fucking idea. No one can or see right him. Now. <laughs> yeah, I remember the last time we did a, uh, a Skype call with him. 
You realize we could literally just lay the audio over the video. That's not that difficult, so everyone uh, could hear. Yeah, it. but I mean, I just like. But so, time. so he it looks could, like we're talking to he, ourselves. Yeah, I mean, he could be he could be like a little picture of the corner. You know, we could put it up on the monitor. Yeah, that is true. <laughs> we could Skype. Hey. Him. we can Skype him right there. And you the, remember how my ass ended up on fucking computer screens? Um, you remember how you taking a piss in the, yes, in the fucking on, um, the, on the video podcast when we did this? How many call? how many computer screens? How many computer in screens podcast. did we put your ass on? I, it's countless. That was uh, what, that was what I just walked into. Yeah, so <laughs> Steel, was, steals ass on computer screens. That's what you was, walked into. It used to be like our literally. We would go dude like, Hankins, we, Hankins all the time. We would go to people's house parties. And then when no one was paying attention, we would use their uh, monitor camera, like, it'd take a picture of Steel's ass and make it their desktop, and, <laughs> and then close out the computer. So the next day, when they went to use their computer, it was Steel's ass as their desktop. <laughs> At what point did people start figuring out, I know that ass? <laughs> no. right. Like that that well, steals ass. Well it happened it happened several times to Hankins. Um and he was never caught he off. would he would always turn his computer off when we showed up. <laughs> like <laughs> Fuck you smart, guys. Smart guy. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you guys. All right, so, I think it only took him like four or five times to finally realize yeah. that hey I couldn't trust my computer around Steel's ass. <laughs> and now he's like a sergeant major. That's fine. Yeah. Everything's cool. <laughs> it's, it's fine because we're not in the military anymore so you know what fuck it I'll still put my ass on the screen <laughs> what well you're not in the service anymore so you know you right. should uh, just text a picture of your ass to him hey, slide, slide, in and, slide in and slide in and DMs <laughs> <laughs> oh god <laughs> <laughs> this is like oh message from Steel what is this fucking butt cheeks damn it <laughs> You got me again. Spread eagle. Twenty years later. No, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. No, there was no, no spread eagle. Ha, it, it, was, it, was, it was. It was. It was. It was. It was. It was tasteful. It was tasteful. Pull down. Like it. There was none of that shit. Dually. He said it was tasteful. It was always tasteful. It was tasteful. Tasteful. And very elegant. Very. Very. It was just a pull down. It wasn't spread eagle. It was just a pull down. No, yeah. You know, you know, you know, little little side cheek, little finger to the mouth, like you glance know, over. It was just a landscape shot of the moon. That's all. Landscape shot of the moon. It was a full moon. Oh shit! shit. <laughs> then there was that one time. Oh god! <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's always it was, that one time. It was the one time after NTC. Remember when we went and uh, like we stepped off the plane? And I was like, "This is your state," and you're like, "Yeah," and I was like, "This state sucks." <laughs> <laughs> and then like this is coming from. The armpit of the world, Fort Polk, Louisiana, and then we came back. It was like what? We were there for like what? Thirty-seven days or something like that. So, Some like so like we uh, <laughs> we go we go to Navarro's house, and that's when we screenshot it. Steals ass on Navarro's computer, and that's when it still had like the desert pimples on his butt. And that was like probably the best one. <laughs> We ever did, <laughs> and they say the Air Force is gay. Uh, well, no, no one said it was gay. <laughs> like, you guys are just like taking care of too much. We yeah. was, we were sleeping on the ground for thirty seven fucking days. Air conditioning, <sighs> motherfucker. We were in fucking Southern California, and like I wanted heat. It was like negative, like fucking twenty degrees there. Your state sucks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, we were by fucking... Can I go uh, to Northern California? We were by uh, Death Valley. Yeah. Where the training camp was. It sucked. So that shit, that shit in August gets like fucking 120 degrees. Yeah, it's hot as shit during the day and then cold as fuck at night. Yeah, it's like sunny. Well, or you go to Fort Polk and it's like Vietnam. Like... <laughs> Either it's way, it sucks. Wherever wet, yeah. we went, it sucked. We did not have AC tents and all that cool shit that the Air Force had. Sounds like overhandling to me. Mm-hmm. Yeah, AC was the thing of the <laughs> Alright, Steely, we're going to let you go. I know you got to drive home. You probably have, like, what, fucking two hours to get there? Uh, No, just an hour. 
Fuck. <laughs> Justin out. What the fuck was that? All right, Steel. Um, we're going to call you. Uh, we'll probably call you next week. Uh, you'll probably be at work, and that's going to be even more awesome. Yeah. Now that we know this whole phone call thing works, <laughs> we're going to fuck with you way more often. Hey, so just so you know, if I fucking call you at 3 o'clock in the morning, you ask better fucking answer. 3 a.m. Your time is 6 a.m. On your here. time. If it was 3 a.m. Virginia Beach time, I know your ass was still awake. 3 a.m. The real question is, does he yeah. have his phone? No. He he constantly walks away <laughs> from his phone. My phone has been on the table all day, and I have like 30 fucking messages right now. <laughs> <laughs> I hope everything's okay no, at work. I'm talking about this was like a couple weeks ago. Oh, I remember. You always like to FaceTime, too. Hey, why you gotta bring up old shit? I mean, you brought it up, motherfucker. You know, he might have been afraid to answer because he was afraid it was going to be a big picture of a big white moon going on, you know? Just, hey, yeah. yeah. It's still, no, I'm not I'm not FaceTiming him. Mm-mm. Not today. Mm. Better not be. Mm, All right, next time you call me just, at 3 a.m., if I'm still awake, I'll answer the phone. Just for old time's sake. I'll have the producer answer the phone. Hey, and you know, you know why I fucking called you that time? No, because you just why. like to make. Yeah, because you just liked a message on Instagram or some shit. I was like, oh, this motherfucker's awake. Oh, no. Let me fucking... You gotta remember, like, I probably dropped the phone on my face because I was asleep. (laughs) 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 No, I do actually remember that, and I ignored that shit straight up. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I looked looked at the producer, and I was like, I'm not answering Steel's phone call right now. Because it's 3 a.m., and if I answer this fucking phone call, I'm gonna be up till 6 a.m., Drinking beers with steel on a little hey, tiny you, tripod because we were gonna FaceTime. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, don't don't make don't sit there and make promises like I'm fucking like I'm awesome. <laughs> you know, I don't want to set you up for fucking failure. It's okay, we know you're not. Oh, oh. <laughs> shot oh, fire! Okay. I All you gotta do is go. Hey, no. first fucking nut shot. Next time I see you. <laughs> Okay. First fucking Can't nut shot it. award goes straight to Dooley. Can't wait for it. <laughs> the first nut shot to Dooley. Heard. At the airport when you pick us up. Hey, guys. <laughs> this is a punch in Dooley's nuts. <laughs> I'll sit there and laugh with you. You remember this from fucking March fucking 7th? Boom. Nice. Right in the- March 9th. Oh, okay. Whatever day it is. Shut up, Sats. 12. <laughs> 12? By the way, I am 12. Huh? Damn. Yeah. All right, Steel. We love you. I love Yo. you, brother. Have a good night. Love you, brothers. Ah, right. Bye, bitch. Peace. Let's <laughs> so we know that works. Cool. Cool guy. This cool is guy. super fun. So, we have Who a beer. Who else do we call? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is going to turn into a bad game. Oh, fuck. I'm out of beer. Wait. I delete it. Yeah. Well, then pass me the cup. I delete it. My bad. Damn it, Dooley. <laughs> Hi. He dooleyed his too. Well, I'm not surprised by that. Do you, Dooley, do you want to go smell first? It. Since you well, already dooleyed like. it? Sure. All right, Dooley. Double bock. Or whatever for the word. It's good. Double bock. Um, 7.2? Yeah. Okay. 50 IBUs. Yeah, I'll give it that four. If it only I drank. So it's good. I would give it a four too. Um, it's a double buck. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, uh, I'm, I think it's an ale. Actually, no. Hold on. It's an ale. Okay. Um, I would say that it's a five. Point six percent, and the ibus, I think that it is low. Um, uh, Twenty eight. Amber ale. Excuse me. Sorry. I will give it to ABV five point eight. Do you think him brought home a girl? Ooh. <laughs> Don't get distracted, Dennis. I know, I know. I'm not trying to get distracted. Um, 20 for the IBUs, and I'll give that a four and a half. 
We do need to talk to her about the fucking bread for the banh mi sandwich. Yes, we do. I'm going to say it's a Weizenbach. It's 6.2%, 36 mm. IBUs, and I'm going to go to three and a half. So you think it's a Bach? I do. Well, that be the well, first do-do-do-do. No, this is a Kentucky bourbon barrel ale. Booyah, bitches. By Lexington Brewing and Distilling Company. Do-do-do-do is 8.2% by alcohol. Oh, it's way under. Way uh, under. Dooley way. came in the closest at 7.2. Yeah, but he didn't say it was an ale. Dooley. You fail. Yeah, there you go. Bourbon barrel ale. The clicky clickies. I heard him. <laughs> Nineteen. Not wow. All right. So Dennis, you came the closest at twenty. Still over. No, I. Hmm. God, I I, 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 Jason's it. gonna get a point. He called it on the ale. All yeah, of this I one said, elsewhere. I said, so. I said I am real. So yeah. You said amber ale. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So I want to. Yeah. yeah well, you're I'll, the commissioner. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm giving it to you. Okay. Yeah, you suck. I'm just saying. I, 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 I don't I, make me get another toothpick. Fuck you. <laughs> I ain't gonna do it anyway, so we're good. <laughs> Fucking stab it in your arm. <laughs> that Actually, would be that's... so much worse. I might stab it. Man, I'd rather take a I, taser. I still have to. Ooh. Oh, no. no. Let's not do that. No. You, you're t- gonna do what? I, I said I'd rather, not I will. Alex says, I you would know, rather. You don't, you don't know what the producer's capable of. <laughs> Y'all gonna work together. Do so, you need a beverage? Know. You look like you need a beverage. Who? I need a beverage. The producer. Oh. <laughs> I, that was a no, no. Since she refuses to comment currently. <laughs> she refuses to tase you. Oh, since you were up, Dooley. <laughs> you know, for some reason, I don't think she would refuse to tase me. I have a feeling she might jump at the chance. <laughs> you knew it was coming, bro. Yes, I would like one too. Thank you. That's fantastic. You do, <laughs> Whoa! Oh no! I'm, I'm the princess. Did you hear that? Are you going to take that? Are you sure you don't want to get a beverage? Well, yeah, because she's a queen. Who hosts? She's not a princess. A weekly public radio program named for her award-winning cookbook, Splendid Table. Ina Garden. Ina Garden. Ina. 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 I N A. G A R D E N. I in a garden. In a. Oh, okay. No. Uh, the no, answer I, is. I, I, I'm, com- I was going to go Martha Stewart. Okay, right. Lynn Rosetta Keeper. <laughs> nope, nothing. I say love that, her. Uh, say that one more time. Lynn Rosetta Keeper. That's better than in a garden. It's on average. What food yeah. company <laughs> used the advertising slogan? Star Kiss. Nothing says loving. Like something from the oven. Jada Kiss. We've already done this one. Jada Kiss. Well, apparently we found that there are repeats on cards, so let's see. Pillsbury Doughboy. Yeah, it's well, Pillsbury, it is, yeah. It is Pillsbury. Uh, nothing says loving. Like something from the oven. True or false? Men man the barbecue at a higher rate when entertaining than at other times. Uh, they it's true. We, we de- we've definitely done this car before. All right, fine. Hold on. What was the question? It was, she, it was cause, true. Because the producer said bullshit. It's actually us because you're too busy talking. Yes. Wow, Stats, you are very... Uh, Damn. Adamant? Yes. No. Well, not adamant. I just... I remember. What American cook was awarded the French Legion honor in t- 2000? In 2000? Johnny Knoxville. So 20 years ago. Hold on. The American cook? Who was awarded the French Legion of Honor in 2000. Hmm. Is that American cook? American? Graham Care? I'm going to go. I'm going to pull up Bobby Flay. Julia Child. Ooh. It's close. I should have seen that one. That was in the right time frame. It's pretty close. close. Pretty close. (laughs) Pretty close on on the Bobby Flay. (laughs) <laughs> no, I, no, I said Johnny Knoxville had a J in the first name, so. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Who wrote yeah. Jewish Cooking in America? Oh. A companion cook, uh, a companion cookbook to her public TV series and chronicled American food culture in The New American Cooking. So I'm bitch. sure my sister would fucking know that. Shit. Shut up. I mean, there's so many bad things I can say. Yeah, I know. Um, and I, I can only imagine the shit going through Alex's head. Um, I got, I got nothing because I can't. I can't. 
Joan and Nathan. Okay. Uh, Joanne, I'm not really positive. Yeah, you know, I'll tip my tongue. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. What two serving pieces are found on a served platter of food? Fork and a spoon. Yep. Fork and knife. Yeah, I was about to say fork and knife. Not on a serve. Platter. I got two fork and knives and two fork and spoons. Yeah. yeah. Not on a serve platter. They should already be cut. Yeah. Fork, fork and a spoon. spoon. Yeah. All right. What does the Wheaton shucking machine use to open 60 oysters per minute? We've definitely done what? this one, too. That's why I one? thought I was right. Shuckers. <laughs> Wait, what? Well, what does it do? It shucks oysters. What does the Wheaton shucking machine use to open 60 oysters per minute? Oh, what does it use? Yes. Um, I do not remember doing this one. Because I would remember the same like a, a, a motor? <laughs> like, I say a robot? Uh... What about like arms? Infrared light. Oh, I know I remember this, yes. Did we Technology. do this one? Yeah. We have? Yeah. Well, All right, well, since none of us are getting them right, let's try again. Anyway. <laughs> what is the name of a shellfish dish that combines Italian and English words to say the same thing twice? Shrimp scampi. Yep. Yeah, sure. 100% right. That is correct. Shrimp and shrimp. Scampi are prawns, large shrimp. Uh, true or False. False. <laughs> I just wanted to see if you were uh, right. Uh, to speed up the <laughs> ripening process, place unripe fruit in a loosely closed paper bag with an true. apple. That's true. That's true. Perhaps. It is true. The bag, <laughs> <laughs> the bag traps the ethylene gas from the apple and makes yeah. fruits ripen. It saves the fart music. Got it. Saves the fart music. So if we uh, put Dennis in a paper bag... <laughs> That's not music. Oh, well, he would ripen faster, right? Or art. <laughs> it's not art. I think that's I might mature right. faster, yes. Sometimes. I don't know if maturing is ever going to happen. No, um, I don't think so either. <laughs> All right, so you want to pull a topic well, while you crack a beer? <clears throat> uh, I just need your cups. Beer's already cracked. Well, I heard it. No, I heard it. Heard. Just take my double cup. Dooley's a double cup. I don't, want, I, don't, I don't want his Corona. You don't want Corona, you, you, you want my Corona? You want my Corona? My, my, my Corona. My, my, my Corona. Alright, so. So. Oh, I have to delete that one. That one. So we're going back to the uh, restaurant sucks, or? Yeah, I, I'm a big fan of the restaurant sucks. The restaurant sucks in general because the people working in the restaurants don't uh, fucking you care. Um, yes, please. What for yourself? Uh-huh. Snack. What? You need a snack? There's juicy Lucy's inside. Like we literally made them. Literally. 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 What the fuck? Did you miss the cutoff? What are you doing? It's the reverb. No, it's not. That's only in your head because you're on lag. Face. Is smoking and barbecue the same thing? No. Damn, Butcher, you're quick to the fucking point. Sorry. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I mean, I concur with the Butcher. But, like, <laughs> like you gotta, you gotta look at it. Uh, I mean... There's so many definitions. You know... Barbacoa. Is the in the in the sense of the fucking word is like cooking over sticks, right? I, so smoking is still cooking over sticks. Is smoking barbecue barbacoa? And if you teach a man to barbecue, <laughs> he eats for one day. Well, so here's the real trick: teach a man to smoke, he'll drink beer all day. <laughs> so here's the real question: because I feel like. Fuck, this is difficult. This uh-huh. is a tough one. I like it. Uh, barbecue doesn't have to be smoked. No. But so no, are I mean, we are we saying this is kind of like a bourbon whiskey situation where like anything is smoked call. is is now considered barbecue? Anything cooked over sticks would be barbecue. Well, then anything smoked is barbecue. So what we is? made barbecue fucking salt earlier. An interesting way of looking at things. Sounds no sounds a little bit more flavorful than uh, smoke salt. I got barbecue salt, bro. 
there's a that's a big difference between barbecue salt versus smoked salt. No, agreed. Dooley, you want to weigh in on the? Uh... No, he's googling. Well, well, no, he's he, he changed it so nobody sees it. You want to weigh in on whether or not you think barbecue or anything smoked is barbecue? Anything smoked is barbecue, I would say no. I'm not saying that because you could smoke literally anything. So, oh, I know. Anything. So, is a smoked salmon barbecue? <laughs> no. See, that now, no I ain't under, under the rules of anything cooked over stick bean barbecue, the answer is yes. Which is weird because I wouldn't They're consider. Bar- no. no, smoked salmon. No, no. But are we talking no. sticks or chips or chunks? It doesn't. I mean, it's all wood, Dooley. <laughs> it's Giggity. all wood. Like all I, right, all right, all right. you might change the flavor of the chunk size, but it's all wood. <laughs> if it's all wood, it's all said. good. <laughs> Let's ask the producer: Is smoking barbecue, and is barbecue smoking? I don't think that barbecuing anything is smoking. I think. Now I'm confusing my damn self. Um, I think that it's like when you're applying flavor through smoke is a that's me. Um scare the shit out of Melissa. <laughs> there so what do you think? You're like you you watch us do you watch us like fucking Asado spit a pig. Like, you, you know everything we do. Like, what is your outside opinion? Like, because you don't like the flavor of smoke. I can't hear you shaking. No. <laughs> <laughs> and you're behind the TVs. So they can't see you either. No, I, I don't care for things that are smoked. You don't like smoked pork. Like, you, you like it that weird way that you boil it. Mm. What? Yeah. Okay, so here's here's another frame of thought here because... One part of barbecue, I think, might have to be the heat. Like, is there a definition of a temperature? I don't know. So, like, again, Dooley brought up smoked salmon. If you're smoking below 200 degrees, is that considered barbecue? Because now you're not really, like, but, uh, cooking. But originally, like, like we're, I using, think it's we're all using barbecue. We're using an offset smoker, we're using technology. <laughs> but not even, the, not even, like, the Traeger technology. We're using, like, the archaic. In the simplest of terms, you're still yes. cooking over sticks. Yeah, like it's just our sticks don't melt or burn like we <laughs> gotta love those melting sticks. <laughs> we cook, and the smoke comes from the side, and I, like smoking things have been like a way of preserving food for a long time. And is barbecue? I am going to say in my, my grilling, answer is, like like what people. I'm having a barbecue at my house. Like you're grilling hamburgers, you're not. You're not having a barbecue. Like I think in the instance of we'll the, uh, barbecue and smoking, I think are essentially the same thing. If you cook your burgers over an open fire grill instead of a gas grill, does that make? Oh, they say you're using charcoal, like or like my dad did it forever, and I think charcoal lends to the flavor of the most delicious things ever, like cheeseburgers. I mean, fuck, man. It's my spirit food. And we get natural charcoal, charcoal which is <laughs> like You guess charcoal what? a burger and like, all right, so you charcoal a burger and like he, every dad has done it and my dad is to blame. I blame you, dad. I'll call him right fucking now. Um, smokes a burger, doesn't grill a burger. The, the temperature is not right and like that's when your burger is like pink all the way through. And like you made the best smoke ring ever on a fucking cheeseburger. <laughs> like... You smoke the shit out of this, and I'm, uh, it's delicious, uh, but it tastes like Kingsford. See, that's, uh, that's, that's why I think... King, yeah, that's a delicious Kingsford mash like fucking barbecue. That's why I think temperature has to come into this discussion. Okay, so... Well, all right, so where are you on temp? I, I feel like it... I mean, it's got to be at least 300. All right. Like, anything... You, go ahead. Let's no, talk to no, the no, budget. No, no, go ahead. No, go ahead. Well, no, I was go just going to say, no, like, no. If, it's, if it's over 300, I feel like whether or not it's being smoked or... Like, over an open fire, it would be considered barbecue. Yeah. My uh, dad used to smoke the shit out of some cheeseburgers, dude. I, well, that's barbecue cheeseburgers, bro. Like, we haven't done it here. Barbecue's a grill. Smoke. Uh, now I want to smoke. Would y'all like to see the definition? 
right. Yeah, okay. Yes. <laughs> That's a good I, idea. I do have a documentary I want you to watch, though. It's on Netflix. Well, then tell the people. Okay. So everyone can watch it together. It's called Toto Sobre El Asado. It's about Argentinian barbecue. Okay. And, you know, because we have our asados. Oh, we have the, yeah, yeah. All right. Now, keep in mind, okay, this is Argentinian barbecue, so they're... Cuts are going to be called a different name than what you're probably used to. Like, they call New York strip steak a rump steak. Okay. I've, I've heard of that. Yeah. That, and then, uh, like, the tri-tip they call the uh, beef tail. Okay. Which I laugh because they're, like, they're like, oh, it's, it's a very, very popular cut with women. And I'm like, dude, tri-tip is fucking delicious. <laughs> tri-tip is a popular cut with anyone who yeah, likes meat. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like... But no, they, like they break they break the cow down into literally into three. What was, the, what was the Brazilian cut that we really fucking like? Picanha. Picanha. Where the fuck does that come from? It's the cap off the top of the sirloin. Okay. Which is funny because the tri tip is actually the bottom of the sirloin. So the flavor is similar. Yeah. Uh, this the top has that. that, it, that the fat, fat cap on it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's important. Yeah, because there's three cuts. There's three cuts to the sirloin. Is you've got the cap, which is the picanha. Then you've got your center cut sirloin, and then you have the tri-tip at the very bottom. So going back to barbecue. Barbecuing is usually done outdoors by smoking meat over a wood or charcoal. So smoking and barbecuing is the same thing. Yes. Then, in the definition. Yeah, uh, we're not. Okay. Include smoking, roasting, and grilling. The technique is uh, smoke temperatures. Now, grilling and barbecuing are different yeah. fucking things. Most people get them confused, like my dad, and I'll call him out. No, I'll call him right fucking now. Yeah. Right. We know this works. I'm sure, I said that. I know, but he used to smoke the shit up a fucking cheeseburger. Mm. It was delicious. So basically, uh, just one of the little notes here is the technique for which it is named involves cooking using smoke at low temperatures and long cook times, several hours. So I guess it doesn't necessarily have to be high heat. How long do you think we can cook a cheeseburger? How big of a cheeseburger? Because I really days. feel like that makes a difference. Well, we've already done. How long? Can, yeah. How long can we cook it for? How long is it still going to be edible? How how low and slow? Eighty can degrees, you? four days. Uh, you can die. Uh, <laughs> I'm not doing shit. Four Guess how much you can charge for that motherfucker, though. <laughs> well, no. you can die. Uh, <laughs> I was thinking like an hour. <laughs> you like, went four days. Well, he four also went 80 degrees. degrees. It's not even going to come up to medium rare. Like, in four days? But at 80 okay. degrees, Dooley? Okay, leave let's okay, talk 100. About, let's talk Excuse about the, me. Let's, let's talk about the temperature danger zone of ground beef. Are, are you doing a uh, sous vide <laughs> over there or something? <laughs> or like, what the fuck? I'm, t- I'm just throwing out some fucking numbers. Oh, yeah, I don't serving. think it matters. We're not, we're not even into, like, yeah. we're still under rare, Dooley. Like, you're serving raw meat. You could leave that shit in your car for four days and do this experiment. Okay. Ooh, in the summertime. Okay. If you want to, if you want to do that in your car, you feel more than free days. to. I'm just saying, eighty degrees for four well, days. Just put it in the doable. trunk with all his clothes. Just leave it out in the summer. Who gives a shit? As long as the raccoon doesn't find it, we'll be fine. On the hood. Hey, I, you can leave it out in the backyard in the summer. It's eighty degrees outside. Summertime, you can fucking cook damn cookies in your car. You do this to yourself. Uh, y'all don't always make me do it to my fucking self, don't you? No, 100 mm-hmm. degrees, dude? Come on. All right. He said 80. And Not then wrong. he moved it up to 100. Like, that was better. Temperature danger zones, sir. Suck my... Shots fired? I, I, don't, I don't know what that's saying. All right, so... Pick his out, boys. <laughs> All right, so... Don't do it. Don't do it. We're going to do this drink. Don't do it. All right. I won't do it. Let's do this drink. You said it, though. He's going to fucking do it. Oh, you know he's going to do it. I said it because it was the what right you, moment. All right, so that... Why that, don't I trust you? I know you. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> I wouldn't trust me either. Um, but <laughs> um, I, that citrus, anyone? I, I think it's a hazy. Little, little hazy? I, don't, I think it's a hazy IPA. Um, I'll go 6.2% ABV, IBU... Oh, uh, again. I'd try. <clears throat> I had most of it earlier. Yeah, I'm gonna say the IBUs, the IBUs are the IBUs. coming up around. I'll say 55. 55 IBUs. 55 IBUs, and I'm gonna give it a. I give it a three and a half. 
Dennis? If I can have another sample. Hey, your job sucks. I appear. Get the nose. You feel the citrus. Oh, feel the cool. citrus. Oh. IPA, I keep going. IPA. You want to taste? 6.5. Are you sure you don't want to sip it? I'll give that a 40. If and that, That's actually pushing it. I'll give that a 3. It's not bad. Actually. Like I can drink that. I'm fucking lying. Dooley? There it is. Wait for it. I knew it was coming. Um, we're trying to go. I love the smile she's got. IPA. <laughs> Six point five percent. Fifty five IBU. Everyone knows. <clears throat> I'll give it a. Don't give it a three. I'm gonna go IPA 6.8 46 IBUs and I'm gonna give it a 3. I feel like Boss Hog right now. A 3? This? A 3. <laughs> this is 3 notched first edition Gold Star Series American Pale Ale. Oh. So it's an, I, or an APA, yeah. not an IPA. Uh, you this were is, right last time. Right now, right? This is 5.5%. Uh, Everyone went over. And I'm assuming, Dooley, you are looking up some Ibus. 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 Which one? Exactly? Uh, Alex. What's yeah. It? Three. Uh, here. Three notch. Well, no, yeah, but they got. Uh, was, oh, it's the. Yeah. Can you pass me your Miller real quick? I just want to see something. Oh, that's. Oh, that's that. Oh, here's that one. It's a veteran one. Uh, maybe. No, no. Uh, the thirty-five. Uh, the fuck are you doing? Talk to the people. They're watching you on camera. Yeah, I know, right? Well, I'm very interested in the fact that they have this labeled as 12 fluid ounces and it's a 16 ounce can. Mm. Yeah. That is different. Uh, three notched. I'm going to shoot you a message because this might be a legal thing. <laughs> hey, three notch. Uh, <laughs> 35 for you. Hey, we'll keep our mouth shut for some sample. This is a relation. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you said 5.5 5, ABV, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I mean, it's too late now because Alex already so called him out. But I mean, like, right, thirty-five. I. Uh, Let's be honest. No all right, no one got this one. Like, I was close. Uh, you were the closest at forty. But you were still yeah, over. We all we all went over on everything. So I'm not giving this to anybody. What's, like what's, what's, what's the score right now? Uh, you yeah. have one. <laughs> he's he's, 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 he's wanting to reconcile that. I right? also uh, took it on Monday. Yeah, just, yeah, just so you guys know. Me and Chuck, we've been talking. Yeah, that's it. That, that's you what going there on any days off? It's all fucking luck. <laughs> I gotta make the producer a drink. Really? Um, so drink what I'm gonna do? Um, I'm gonna do you got the topic. Oh, that's Dude. fucking fantastic! Have you seen this? It shows your faces. The bottom, both of you have the same. Like your hats turned backwards. I didn't know this. It looks like we're fucking. Video uh, game characters. Uh, dear well, God, just finish that sentence. That's all I have to ask. The whole thing is like. <laughs> <laughs> you calling it me or Jason? You. You had oh. a horrible moment of pause there. It looked. It was like a fucking second pause. Like <laughs> it looks like we're fucking some shit. All right. <laughs> it looks like video we're game. fucking. He said video games. Yeah. I. It. Yeah. yeah after a moment. It's too long fi- of a moment. Fi- fi- finish your sentence. The the best part was like one of the one of my friends like was like, "Holy shit, is Limp Bizkit getting back together?" <laughs> <laughs> I was like, and, uh, "That's a shot fire." On yeah. All yeah. Those. And Nick well, Rice, okay, he killed it. He was like, "Holy shit, Limp Bizkit getting back together?" <laughs> Chocolate starfish. <laughs> the hot, hot dog, dog flavored, flavored water. water. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna go make the producer a drink and I'm gonna leave you guys with a topic because I have these things somewhere. Well, I'll give you an Urban Dictionary word. That's a good one. We talked about cauliflower pizza crust. What do y'all think night water is? When you take a piss in the middle of the night. No, the water you drink when you wake up in the middle of the night and it tastes like it came from the mountain spring, blessed by God Himself. <laughs> 
obviously these people. Dictionary word of the day. Obviously these people don't drink enough. I don't wake up in the middle of the night. I'm just gonna. Uh, well, you drink like Dude. fucking seven Gatorades before you go to bed. Oh. <laughs> Who did that? What? That came all on the podcast. Holy shit! I love right, how you Joker. Can hear him laughing from outside. That was impressive. Okay, your favorite restaurant as a kid. I think we've done this one, buddy. I know, but like, I gotta make the producer drink. Well, we'll come up with another topic. Yeah, Nick one, not having to do anything with Dennis's ass. <laughs> I, mean, I blame him. He gave you the fucking capsaicin. Right? <laughs> now, this is just backfiring, literally. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. We didn't talk much about that cold brew, other than the fact that, uh, you know, obviously it's made by Jameson. Yes. It's obviously very popular since they almost ran out. Yeah, and, it's a uh, edition, so... You know, what What do you think of it? Obviously, it's your bottle. I mean, uh, I, I, I did think it was pretty good. It, it had good. a real coffee flavor yeah, to it. it I has mean, a true coffee flavor to it, yeah. I'm not a huge coffee fan, so it didn't appeal to me that much. But, yeah. like, I could I could see that going well in drinks. Like, in mixed drinks Ooh, in particular. You know yeah. what I mean? Uh, Ooh, mix it with some, like, some rum chata. I was thinking, like, a Kahlua-type drink. Uh, mm-hmm. What you, like white Russian, mm-hmm. you know, like Ooh, it replacing Russian, replacing yeah. like the Kahlua or, yeah. or or possibly the Kahlua and the vodka to be quite frank yeah. with that. So you could literally just have like a cream and Ooh. Jameson cold brew. Drink. So I all right, so with the cream and <laughs> see I, pauses are bad. Yeah, uh, yeah I, I, got, I got another uh, actually urban now dictionary that you say word. That, I'm gonna try that on Wednesday. I'm gonna I'm gonna take the like the half and half and everything, just make a fucking damn white Russian with this. Wait, uh, I was just scrolling through urban you, dictionary. You down? Yes. All right. We have to do some aesthetic things. I'm just scrolling through Urban Dictionary. Oh, yeah. Just guess what a ground harness is. I'm afraid of Urban Dictionary and I'm scared. Shoes. The device used by Australians to prevent them from falling into the sun. Wait, what? (laughs) Ground harness. The device used by Australians to prevent them from falling into the sun. Is there a photo? Well, you know, you haven't dropped. Wait, wait. Aussie 1. Hey, mate, your ground harness is getting loose. Aussie too. Thanks, mate. Would have fallen into the sun without, without that. Why is that a fucking word of the day? Like, <laughs> ground harness. You know, you haven't been drunk till you've been like hanging onto the blades of grass and everything. For, <laughs> for actually, I funny mean, that you're just not I saying just, that. I just want to know what they're tethered to. Funny that you're just they're, not saying that because the but next how? one, like, do they just like stick a rope in the ground? The, the next one is uh, speaking cursive. It's when you're so drunk that you don't know what the hell you're saying, and no one else does either. Uh, that's pretty much you all the time. Fuck you. What was that? <laughs> Boom. Just did it to myself. Boom again. He's, Boom. He's, 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 fuck you. No, this <laughs> is the fuck you. Julie, it's time to get out. I'm awake. I'm done for now. I'm awake. Sandwiches. Um, so we're going to talk about some... Uh, we've been on this kick of sandwiches. What? Where are we at now? How many weeks are we in? What, what week know. is this? Uh, I've, I've confused myself. We're I mean, definitely ahead of the... Uh, well, of course. Shh. Shh. Don't say anything. I would no, have to guess that. we're around week 9 or 10. No, we're we're 10. Ahead of the We've been through two we're months. To do. We're we, into the third. I'm going to go this is week 10. We have not even we got gotten... It. We have not even gotten halfway through. We're week 11. We're in week 11. We haven't even gotten halfway through Sandwiches. For every state, and the the Moonflata is, I think, one of those ones that is coming up, and I think um, we need to do the Polish dog soon. Um, I got Polish kibasa. Okay, at the shop. Yeah. Okay, so we need that. All right, I got you. (laughs) Dilemma number one down. Yeah. Okay. So um, I don't know what bread that comes on, but we also have the bot meat. It's a hot. It's a hot. And I think if we're gonna pickle things, we might as well pickle all the things. For several sandwiches at one time. That does sound like a plan. So, cause I think did, I might have cucumbers. Homegrown. You think you might have cucumbers? Yeah. That's cool, because none of these sandwiches call for those. Um, <laughs> it's called pickles. <laughs> That's pickling. <laughs> we are what? pickling, not Do pickles. cucumbers become... After you're done pickles. Well, yes, they become pickles, but we're not trying to pickle cucumbers to get pickles. We are trying to pickle other items. If Peter Piper picked a pickle, pickle peppers. 
can't you say that five times? fucking make some goddamn kimchi. If Peter Piper picked the peck of pe- pickled peppers... Hey, nope, you can't do it one time. I'm going to try it again. You ready? Go. If Peter Piper picked the peck of pickled peppers... If Peter Piper picked the peck of pickled peppers... If Peter Piper picked the peck of pickled peppers... You're nope. taking breaks? No, nope. <laughs> no. You're, you're <laughs> taking, you're taking breaks. You can't do that. <laughs> All right, Dilly, go. Fuck, 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 fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Fuck, 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 fuck you. I can't do it. That's why I decided to say fuck you. You told not even ask me for that shit. <laughs> Hell no. Peter um, I, also, I can barely uh, talk I have, when I'm doing a video on fuck for Team Fat Kid. I do have about? a little topic. Oh, do you? A little one? A little one? Well, How little is it? A little? Well, we don't want to know. Ha, ha, ha. God, I love a present of space bar. But <laughs> okay, so you know how uh, no mother <laughs> fuckers. <laughs> you know if you stop talking every time he interrupts you, you're never gonna get this out. True. Okay, so you know the method of cooking with salt curing underground, right? Nope. Uh, that's that. That's curing. That's not cooking. It's still cooking. It. No, it's not. No, it's, not. it's curing. Google cooking. Yeah. <laughs> Google curing. <laughs> yeah, both of those. And then do I want to do a side-by-side comparison because you you're wrong. I'm just, I'm gonna, yeah, it is. I'm just um, going to kick something. Yeah. And someone's cool. going to fall on someone. You're fine. <laughs> um, these, these legs are screwed in. I did it um, in garbage. Oh, yeah. You you okay. you salted cooking something? Salted a whole fish. Okay. And then five weeks later, you cured the fish? Love how that no, I, I think he's way. curing it for five weeks. Yeah. So I was gonna um, say, in five weeks, did you cook hey, it? You got it. Oh, he, hey, go. While most properly <laughs> cured foods are considered fully cooked, not all of them are palatable for eating. Curing is often done without heat, using chemical process to draw moisture and make the food inhospitable <laughs> to microbes. Can we can we talk about like? Preserved lemons, you don't cook them, right? I'm done. Yeah, yeah. So, what what I was saying is like, um, so you preserve things, doesn't mean you cook them. What do you do with the fish after you cooked it in salt? <laughs> I'm just asking. I mean, because the people want to know. Like, you're not just talking to us just because you can see us. You're talking to people. And they want to know how Okay, you, so we're from our sponsors. You, <laughs> how did you cook this fish? <laughs> and then did you cook it afterwards? I hate everyone. Let's go to a commercial now. <laughs> This podcast is brought to you in affiliation with Stitcher Podcast Radio. Head on over to stitcher.com forward slash premium and sign up today for only four ninety nine a month. Use uh, promo code TEAMFATKID for get one month absolutely free. Stream and download all your favorite podcasts, such as this one, Team Fat Kid Choose the Fat, Conan O'Brien Needs a Friend, My Favorite Murder, Wolverine, The Lost Trail, Alex's Favorite, Bitch Sesh, you get the Fantasy Footballers, Science Rules with Bill Nye, and many, many more. We're talking 21000 Premium hours of podcasting. That is 2.4 years. You get all the bonus episodes. You get the ad-free shows. You get Dooley's favorite 300-plus comedy albums. You can check out all the new releases before they come out. And just remember, all you have to do is head on over to Stitcher.com forward slash premium. Sign up and use the promo code TeamFatKid. Test it out for a month absolutely free on us. Thank you for listening. We'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Alright, so Dooley, um, tell me again how you fucking cook this fish in salt. You, did, you think this, did you just think because you went through a fucking small no. commercial that I was going to forget? No. I cured it in salt. Oh, well, that's not what you said. Yeah. We're having a conversation. What did you do after you cured the fish in salt? Smoked it. Yeah, uh-huh. so then you cooked it. Why do I how hang long, out with any of y'all? How Whatever. Because you learn things. It's, it's hey, not, I it's, love you, all hey, right? It's not just us bashing you. It's an educational experience. So for every other idiot that's like me... <laughs> you're not an idiot. No one said you were an idiot. Hey, you're, no, you're, no, you're, you're an idiot. No one said it. I am. Those are I'm, your words. Hey, did the, can you hear me? Yeah. 
No. 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 Uh, I don't think he unmuted you after commercial. No, I'm mute. unmuted. Oh, I can't hear you. It, it, well, then um, mute yourself and check your mic cord. Don't be a Jason. Don't be a Jason. You know, that's yeah, nope, really weird. No, nope. Oh, what the fuck did you do? I did. It's Dooley's fault. <coughs> oh, I can hear you. I can yeah, hear, I can hear try it. Talk. We're going to go ahead and mute for that. That's a good no, idea. Okay. But I feel like... Dooley, I swear if you hit that button before he plugs it back in, I'll kill you. Mm. All right. There we go. There it is. Okay. He's back. Yay! Yay! Yay. I mean, I could hear you, but it was just through Julie's microphone. <laughs> I was good with that. I'm sure you were. <laughs> all right, so. Sorry, I'm $10 richer tonight. That's all that matters. I'm going to read two questions, and we're going to get into a beer. Okay. okay. Two questions. What Cuban drink made popular by... Mojito. Cochino. Ernest Hemingway is said to have been invented in 1896 by an American working in Cuba. Coquito. Mojito. The daiquiri. Oh. Bitches. Yeah. Nobody's blender it's ever. Works. Nobody's blender <laughs> ever ever works at the bar. What film was Starbucks Entertainment's first movie venture promoted on about four million beverage sleeves a day? You've got mail? Moana. Huh? Moana. That's what she said. Is it's that a like Disney a... movie? Oh. Oh. You've got mail. How do you know these things? Uh no, the you? answer is Aquila and the Bee. 2006. Really? I, I, I don't know what that is. I think it's a Disney movie. <laughs> it's possible. Billy, Google. Oh, damn. <laughs> well, he, he oh, no, I got that's you. cool. Let's get into this beer. All right. Also, not Dooley. I don't want to... Aquila and the Bee. Get into Dooley. Damn, you got up and then uh, turn on the heater. Still, walk right past it. I thought... Well, you thought what? <laughs> you don't feel the terrible fucking mess. No. Exactly. There okay, fuck. Time. I smell chocolate, so I think coffee. Uh huh. I'm there. I haven't tried but it, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm, Thanks, Dooley. You're going coffee. You're gonna I'm gonna say that it's chocolate. Uh, fuck. It's fuck. a Dennis beer. Therefore, I give it a two. See, I really, I think it's chocolate, but I'm gonna go coffee. I think it's chocolate, and I'm gonna stick with it. Chocolate what? Crap. Um. Usually, people don't okay. make crap in oh. beers. Yeah. Yeah. Have they met you? Okay, so <laughs> I'm I'm not a fan. I think it's like a chocolate coconut. Um, actually, no. Dennis, go. I'm gonna come back to you. By the way, it's Lionsgate Films, not Disney. For Aquila and the Bee, it's about a spelling bee movie. Because that sounds like something I should probably watch. Yeah, right. My spelling sucks. Just say. I blame Florida. Dooley, I'm coming to you. Coffee style. All right. Good Dennis, job, Dooley. Dennis goes. <laughs> what do you think it is? Yeah, this, this isn't my wheelhouse, so I have to think a little bit longer on that. Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, you think a lot anyways, but that's beside the point. Well, <laughs> you don't need the button. We're not going to knock you. Not yet. Not that yet. comes later. Yeah. Okay, let's stand there. I mean, I can reach over there. And Dennis, go. what else you got, man? Yeah, uh, coffee stout, six point one. <laughs> this podcast is brought to you in affiliation uh, with Stitcher uh, Podcast Radio. Forty, and then I'll give it four. Jason, I'm gonna go. That it is a chocolate milk stout. You heard me. Really? It's not as good as the PBR. No, nowhere near as good as the PBR was. Um, I give it a two, which I already said. Um, I think the ABV is somewhere, I'm going to say like a 5.9. Uh, just yes. And the IBU, probably somewhere in like the, I'm good. Um, the oh, 20. 20, heard? 20. All right, duly. What the hell is going on back there, bro? I'm going to go with a coffee porter. Ooh, that's a good one. I'm, I'm, I'm it's sweet, but I, I, I'm feeling a lactose in there. Uh, you know, I, I'm hesitant to go porter, I'm not going to lie, but I want to be a little different. I'm going to go coffee porter, 5.8, 30 IBUs, and I'm going to give it a 2.5. Dually, it's on you, sir. Coffee porter, 8.5. Maybe about 40 IBU. I'll give it a 4. 40 IBU? 
Down this went the same. Is, is right. it bitter? Is it? Do you think it's, it's bitter because of coffee, coffee or yeah. is it bitter? Actually, cause... this is cold brew coffee porter. Ooh. Cujo is the name of the beer, and this is by Flying Dog. So, what is that? Huh? Dually, what is you and I are both in coffee porter. Oh, so. Uh, it is a six percenter. Dooley, you went way high. I came in at five point eight here. That's and uh, if you would look up Cujo, like the dog from Stephen King, by Flying Dog. The artwork on Flying Dog's bottles, you in on anything is K U J O. There you there go, Cujo is. Porter. Down to it. two clicks down. There it is. Still trying to get used to this fucking keyboard. <laughs> it's a fucking keyboard. Fifteen. Fifteen. Wow, we all went way it's over a, on it's that. A, it's a Corey keyboard. Jason came in closest at twenty on that one. I'm taking this point saying, though. <laughs> right, you're not giving Dilly a point. I mean, he got the coffee porter part, but he went way high on ABV. It sucks to be Dilly. Think normally, like not just this time. <laughs> 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 Where's that space bar now? Can I get a little more of that? Like you can have yeah, mine. Here, you can have it. He's like, here. Oh, y'all read that. I just need the bottle. I know. <laughs> Other than that, I don't care. I don't. Sorry, I don't partake in that. Don't search that, please. Yeah, dude. It, we are on Alex's fucking. <laughs> oh, so I should search a whole bunch more like that, shouldn't I? <laughs> if I get home, and... when you go home, and the FBI <laughs> is out front. Yeah. I don't think and, it'll be the FBI. The white van. Just give him Dooley's phone number. It, if he searches that, it's going to make it look like I'm the guy in the white van. Uh, we <laughs> with just eat candy. <laughs> Free candy. Producer, <laughs> you should not be laughing that hard, oh, no, okay? She's like, laughing. She she's knows. like, I can totally see him as the guy in the <laughs> white van. Because the entire time we've been doing this podcast, Dooley's Googled all this shit under Alex's name. That's what the, the little E in the corner. Yeah. I mean, you have to press enter for it to actually search. I could put in anything on the search bar. Well, I don't know. You've you still you... searched some weird shit under, under my name. Like, I just Especially don't... the third page. Uh, first off, I don't want my Alexa looking at me weird. Because right, you're on my Wi-Fi, <laughs> and my Alexa does follow me around the room. Like, she follows you around the house. What are you talking about? She scares the shit out of him. That's the Roomba. That's the Roomba. I'm including yeah. that. <laughs> Alexa, tell the Roomba not to scare Jason. <laughs> but it's weird, like when like all of a sudden it lights up by itself and it just starts spinning, like looking for you. Like, did you say something? You say something? Like, no, I was not talking to you. Um, sorry. All right, so let's talk about uh, the FBI and Alexa. Um, do you guys think that that's a, a thing? No. I'm sure she works no. for the CIA. Amazon's the only one actually that will not, you know, actually contain all your information. Like, Amazon won't? Yeah. They've actually came out and said they will not like you know store your personal data like that and everything. I I disbelieve that shit because like I buy a shit ton of fucking shit. This entire table came off of Amazon. Um, and well, not it, the table. It, well, yeah, not the table. Or the monitors. Not the surface. Or the monitors. Yeah. Shut your face. <laughs> everything else. Totally. Including yeah. the. Including the fucking headphones that we were listening. Through, came. Doing True, I bought mine through on Amazon too. So, Dooley, yeah. if you drink all this, you are not getting more. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a shit ton on that one. If you gulp that down, bet. you are not getting more. <laughs> bet uh, that you're not getting more. Most Absolutely, Virgin- bet. most Virginia thing bet. ever said on a podcast. Which bet. Is <laughs> it, it looks hazy. It mine looks starting there. This starting there because I. Poured twice as much in your fucking cup. Smell. Lucky. Smells pretty. Hazy. That's the most you said the whole time. Like, holy shit, your microphone actually works. She's just it's been, been on the entire time. And she's just... She's been just listening to us make fun of Dooley. Um, it's got some apricot. Hello, how are you? I'm keeping it simple. I'm going to go with uh, IPA... Uh, 6.2. I'm going to put it at about 32 IBU, and I'm going to give that a 4. I'm going to say it's a juicy IPA. It's a 8.4. 
Um, I think that I have used like this is where I get fucked up because like I I always have no idea when it comes to yeah that works. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna say a uh, 45 IBU, and um. I give it a, I give it a three and a half. Three point five. Dooley. Yes. Rinsey Rinsey. Going back in. And just like like when he does things like that, like I got like, Dennis, you wanna go while he's You should have read that story. He's like little baby say. Yoda. I mean you could pass it over to me, I'll read it in a second. Right. Um I will go with a half of Ison. You're wrong. But you're allowed to continue. I, I will. <laughs> How kind of you. I know, right? 5.8%. And I'll you go think with... Heffy is 5.8. Sorry. Shut your face. You know, both of you just keep stopping talking when he says stuff, and you should just well, fucking I ignore know. him. I, I it's really about. easy. <laughs> yeah. I promise you. Take one of your just keep talking. You it, it won't matter. It, 30 I views. Wash me out. 30? Yeah, I'll give it three and a half. <laughs> See, trust me. Just keep talking over him. He'll, well, he'll, he'll, he'll either keep talking or he won't. It'll be fine. Dooley? Wrong. Okay. Unfiltered, double IPA, 8.7%, 70 IBU. Did you type it down? <clears throat> what are you looking at? What was your percentage? 8.4? 70 IBU, 8.4 ABV. And a rating? 8.7. 8.7. And a rating? Stone. This is the easy part, Dooley. Stone. It's a five. I want to say it's you're wrong. The Stone Viking Space Probe. Dear God, just give me a rating, Dooley. Five. If if he is fucking right, you said five. Yeah. You're welcome. And why'd you give him a whole fucking cup? Because he's gonna get that anyway. Okay, but now he feels like it's a stone. Yep, it is. Damn it. So Stone it. Viking Space Probe, double yeah. IPA, unfiltered double in. IPA. Yeah, it is an 8.5 percenter. Yeah, it went over two points. You did. Yeah. You're welcome. Fuck you, I still got the whole damn thing right. <laughs> no, you went hey. over, you don't get the point. Why don't oh. you look at some IBUs while you're on it? What was the IB, or what was the... 8.5. ABV is 8.5, and it is a... Didn't you say he said 8.5, and then he was like 8.7? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm good. You want to taste? So I'm going to read this story, and then I'm going to go back to the last bottle. A hoppy cosmic nebula. In the spirit of all the exploratory missions deployed across the galaxy, be they spacecraft, Viking, or other, we're constantly probing the world of beer back here on Earth. That quest has brought us to this latest creation, which comes from our brewing team at Stone Brewing, Napa. With a subtle uh, haze reminiscent of some far-off nebula and further complemented with the juicy flavors of Ella and Citra hops, this beer is... Most definitely out of this world. Crafted to be enjoyed on Earth, but if intelligent life does exist out there, we're pretty sure they'll like it, too. I gonna, I'm going to get... Did I or did I say like, I, Can I confirm or deny? Confirm what? or deny what? Did you buy it? I bought it today. You son of a All right, real quick, I'm going to read the Cujo bottle because I was told I should. Yes. Enjoy your new pet, he said. Twelve hours later, your heart is pounding with terror as you wake up to find the savage beast growling over a puddle of your neighbor's organs. And that's not coffee on your breath. It's fear. <laughs> Sleep tight, my friend. That's some Stephen King shit, right? right? <laughs> I, 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 I applaud and agree with it. And yeah. I am, I hate when there's a stone and Citra. Julie's right. Well, we should stop buying stone. <laughs> we cannot. We cannot stop buying stone. I know. And we cannot stop buying fucking dog fish. And like, I think my plan. Did you see IBUs on there? 80. 80? Yeah. Damn. Wow. 80? Yeah, it was 80 IBUs. I mean, I gotta give it to Dooley. I, I mean, no, I mean, he got it, but I was like, 80? Like, I did not feel that uh, bitterness. Two things that made me think that. One, you gave me a shit ton. A good amount. Do you realize that I don't know what the beer is, right? I'm just tired of pouring twice for you. <laughs> <laughs> that's two, literally all that was. Two was... That's right? Yeah, no, that's the, legit. The other reason was because why I kept on spinning it. Is because I know the uh, the head on this liar. Look, Dooley's no. really good with head. No, he's got he's got to switch back to the program before uh, you can hit the baseball. There you go. Anyway, so <laughs> the head and the color of the uh, 
So you've had Dig this, that so, hole, Dooley. So you've had this one before? Would you like yes. a shovel? Would you? So is it... Do like, you remember... Two hands? Do you remember when we went to... <laughs> was it? Was it? Casual no. Pint the other day? Yeah. Like last week or whatever? Yeah, when we hung and out. And I bought... Uh, Viking Space Probe. I did not partake in it because like you're like, let me try that one. And then you drink it by yourself and you don't share. No, I bought the six pack. Oh, you took how the But that was way before right now. Like that was last week. Surprise way, question. That was way before that was, right now. That was <laughs> way, way before. That's how I'm gonna start describing last week all the time. Way that before right way now. Way before right now. That was last week. <laughs> Surprise question. In which cuisine, Chinese, Japanese, or Korean, is it not customary to hold a rice bowl close to your mouth? Mm. Can I get the can I get the Wait, Korean. Japanese? Say that again? In which cuisine? Chinese, Japanese, or Korean? Is it not customary to hold a rice bowl close to your mouth? Chup Japanese. Chinese. I've got one Chinese, one Korean, two Japanese. I'm Chinese. Japanese. I'm a Japanese. Two Japanese. It is Korean! Point to the producer. Oh, shit. Really? What is coral in a lobster? The egg. Uh, Yeah, I don't know. Anybody else want to weigh in? Yeah. Fucking a lobster? Infection. What is coral in a lobster? Eggs or yeah, row. the row. row. A reef? It is, in day, it is indeed the row. Eggs that turn the color of coral when it cooked. It is indeed. <laughs> okay, so what <laughs> dining concept was born in Providence, Rhode Island in 1872 when Walter Scott began serving meals from a horse-drawn lunch wagon to late shift workers? Wait, what? Fast food. No one's going to get this. Uh... Well, hold on, read it Raw again. oysters. What dining concept was born in Providence, Rhode Island in 1872 when Walter Scott began serving meals from a horse-drawn lunch wagon to late shift workers? The important part of this is what dining concept was born... Food truck. ...by serving uh, late shift workers? Yes, the food truck. Food I truck? Like fast food. Roach coach. Fast you know? food? Or uh, driving. Nope. It is the diner. Oh, Damn. I wouldn't guess that. Well, I mean. Last one. What is removed from butter when it is clarified? Fat. Nope, we're not fat. Uh, so, I don't know. Yeah, Dilly, do it. Like you, you went to school. We have ghee here. What is removed from butter to clarify it? Impurities. Which are? What are the impurities? Solid? That's half the answer. Solid fat. What is butter? Fat. Butter is fat. Yeah. You're not removing fat. That's why I'm not saying fat. Come on, man. You had to do it. What category does butter fall under while doing inventory? Dairy. Wait, so moving dairy from clever butter. So... Solids is half the answer. Dairy. And it's dairy. What are we removing from butter? Dairy salt. <laughs> okay, well, give me a type of dairy. Mm. Okay, milk solids is the uh, answer. Yeah, you. you think I fucking remember all this shit? Um, I walked oh, into that one. Come on. Like we were steering. As of right now. It's just been clean. All right. All right, I'm going to do one more card, and then I'll crack a beer. Yeah, let's do it. All right, so everyone listening at home, when you clarify butter, are you heated up? The bad Just shit. Skim the, floats to the top. Yes, you skim that off. Yep. And then run it through a cheesecloth, and then you have ghee. Or you just go to the fucking store and spend fucking $10 for a pound. Yeah. Which is cheaper than buying all the butter to make a pound of clarified butter. I done the math. This is cheaper. Just go to the store and buy key <laughs> on your fucking international aisle. <laughs> what Truth. tart is from the Lorraine le- region of France? Quiche. Anybody I else? knew. I knew. Yeah, I'm. I'm going with her. It is quiche Lorraine, indeed. What kind of salad does the Australian <laughs> rock band The Wiggles? Sing two children about they count as a fucking Australian rock band. Isn't, isn't that it? like the kids show? The fucking yeah. Wiggles. Yeah, but wiggle. isn't it a tossed salad? First off, whoa, 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 whoa. It's pre- almost as good. It's fruit salad. <laughs> <laughs> 
Although tossed salad. I'm gonna need you to <laughs> calm down. Right. Some, somebody made the videos. I'm like, Wait, so um, let me get this straight. The Wiggles are singing about tossed salad. No, what the uh, fuck? Yeah, this is a real thing. All right, so we're gonna move on. <laughs> yeah, thank God. We're gonna move on from tossed salad and children's shows. <laughs> yeah. uh, what? Si- <laughs> Why are your fucking heads popping up at the fucking bottom? Is that that should just I'm not that should not be a theme so for anything Google like search. what anyway? What silverware is sometimes placed horizontally above the center of a place setting? Wait, what? The dessert fork. What Sorry. silverware is sometimes placed horizontally above the center of a place setting? Yeah, I'll agree with you. South fork. No, no, not that's the that's the first fork on the outside. It's a dessert fork. Okay, it is a dessert fork or spoon, and if it is a fork, it is with the tines, or if it's a spoon with the bowl, to the the left, pointing to the left. Absolutely. Is that mine? True or false? Probably. It's not pointing toward me. Louisiana (laughs) rice farmers flood their fields to grow crawfish that feed on the remains of the harvest. Come on, true. I'm not even going to answer this question. Well, you are below me. You are Louisiana. (laughs) It's below me. True. True. My first name. It is true. Yes. My first name is the first five letters of that state. What is the most popular month to eat out? I say February. February's a good one. Yeah, my answer's reasoning is probably different. January, January. June. June. <laughs> January. June, July. January, February. July. July, it is August. Damn. Doesn't say why, though. I'm kind of curious about that. Some bitch. All right, last Do one. It. Then I'll get more here. Do it. Do it. Google. Why is August? Because it's hot as fuck in what? your house. What carries a higher because price? Because the oven in your house... That's an old ass question, and I know the answer before he's gonna Google it. Um, because the the temperature in your house is too hot outside to fire up an oven, so you would eat out. To that sounds more like July to me. August, it's middle of summer. No, yeah, it's safe to eat oysters. Okay, right? that doesn't matter. Uh, what yeah. carries a higher price per gram? Saffron. Okay, <laughs> right. Beluga caviar, wild truffles. Saffron or cocaine? All right, cocaine's not in the question, but I feel like I had to throw one in and throw her off. I think it's a caviar. Uh, caviar. Uh, hold on. I will go over the. I, I, I'm waiting. Truffles. Right? It is wild beluga caviar, mm-hmm. wild truffles, or saffron. Truffles. Saffron. Caviar. By the ounce. By the gram. By the gram. I, do, I mean, does it matter? It's, caviar. That's a smaller. Um, it's still going to be priced um, by the weight. I'm going with the producer on saffron. Saffron, saffron. I got a spice. caviar, and you're going truffles. real truffles. saffron. That's just because mushrooms are. Yeah, you don't know anything about mushrooms. It is beluga caviar. Oh wow! I think it is specifically because it's beluga caviar. Only reason I, why I said caviar. Changed my answer though. Only reason I said caviar because said did. about the gram. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, you said about the gram, and I was like, that's English all the fucking way. Um, beluga caviar is not English. It's Russian. Yeah, but at the same time, they still... Whatever, I still grass. got that. Dude, Look. what's our time? Our time is... An hour and 33. All right, so last beer? Yeah, yeah that's probably a good idea. I'm just spilling shit on my chest. Cups, please, gentlemen. Those salt Some vinegar light. chips look delicious. What? Said those salt and vinegar chips look delicious. They were. I think that was Melissa that asking for some salt and vinegar <laughs> chips. They're already gone. I'm sorry. I, I, if I had more, I'd give you he more. He has but... a trash can right beside him. Yeah, I just haven't thrown it away. I'm sorry. What a tease. Right. Well, we also thought we had pocket meat, but then we pulled it out of the pantry yeah, and it was moldy as, as fuck. fuck. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, we weren't ran through our. It, it had been there for a cheese. while. I should have put it in there. Yeah. Actually, we could have put it in the freezer and it probably would have been just as good. Yeah. Frozen. Frozen meats. All right. Gentlemen, initial thoughts. No, just put that anywhere. It's cool. I mean, if it's bad, you don't have to That's throw it away <laughs> for you. Oh, yeah? By the way, flip cup. Flip cup. Nature wins. Always. All right. Who's going first? Cider. Cider. Strawberry cider. Strawberry cider. Five percent. 
I don't know where he got Salmon I'll from. go with... I don't know where he got Salmon from. Wanty. And I'll give it a three. I don't know where you got cider from. Okay. Dilly? What do you... Cider? I don't feel the cider at all. I mean, I can smell it. I see I see where you're getting it. I haven't yeah. tasted it yet, but I see where you're getting it. I can see where he's getting it because there's no bite. Right now, I, all I can... Like, my whole palate is jacked because, like, the wind just blew in and flipped that cup in, like... All the pesticides that I sprayed in my yard are in my face right now. <laughs> give me a second, and I'll come back. I'm going with a wit beer at 4.8. Uh, mm-hmm. I'm going to give it a 24, and I'm going to go with that to a 3. I'm going to go with Alex is wrong. That doesn't narrow it down. I know, right? Not a wit beer. Not, okay. No. I'm going to go amber ale. Okay. What, what are you like looking at? <coughs> You remember that? We're going to save it for later. It's about to happen. (laughs) Amber Ale. Go ahead and get your finger on the trigger. Calling for ABVs. Now (laughs) pre-boarding. It really doesn't pre-board. He has to go to the bathroom. What is pre-boarding anyway? You're either boarding or you're not. Pre-boarding means you have kids on board and they need to go to the fucking bathroom. Okay. Uh, No, that means (laughs) the uh, felt tip is touching the... Dually, ABV. Anyway. Now we're making stains. uh, 6.4... IBU, I'm going to go 15, Ugh. and I'm going to give that a 3. Jason. Lager. 4.7. The IBUs are going to be in the 30 range, so I'm going to say a 32 on the IBU, and I will give it a 3. This is... Three Notch Festivison, a mindfully crafted wheat beer. Damn it! <laughs> Damn it. Do, 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 uh, do, 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 do. It is, I have IBUs, you don't have to look it up. It is 5.2%. I came in the, uh, nope, Dennis came in the closest at 5. Uh, and it is 18 IBUs. Dooley came in the closest without going over it, 15. Uh, you know, I don't. I don't think I can honestly give this to anybody. You, you fucking called it a Weiss. I did. I mean, I called it a wit beer. Or white. Anyway, either way, uh, I, I didn't get closest on IBU or ABV, and I feel like you know, style is probably the easiest. So, as much as I would love I don't to take think that point, style is easy either. <laughs> I think none of this game is easy. Fine, then I'll take the point. I yes, win, bitches. I, I would give you the point. Is what I was saying, but you're the commissioner, and if you say you don't get the point, you don't get the point. Well, too late. I already no, marked it. No, you don't get the point. It's already marked. No, I, I win, bitches. Said. He said no, and then all of a sudden he changed it. So hey, you know. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, thank you for listening Fucking to us on this Del. beautiful Thursday party cast. We appreciate all of your uh, ear listening time, even when it sounds like this. You have way too much fun with that. Way too. Much. As always, guys. You can find us on Facebook at Team Fackhead. On Instagram at Team Fackhead Nation. On Twitter at Team Fackhead One. On YouTube, Team Fackhead. And as always, for all of your uh, clothing and knife needs, you can find us on www.teamfatkidnation.com. So don't forget, guys. Stay hungry. Be creative. And don't, don't forget, forget to sharpen, sharpen your knives. knives. Praise the Lord.